Hi everybody, welcome to new subscribers, my daughter Yasmin's pals, Harry, Jake, Alex and Pip. As Pip asked an update on the, on the bonsai trees, thought it best to do an update on the goings on outdoors. In previous episodes you can probably remember I transplanted the Japanese maple and the Chinese elm into larger pots and put them outside for the season. Link of the video description below. Starting the, on the Scots pine, it hasn't improved or grown but it's still alive. Over to the Japanese maple, you can see the trunk that I was snapped when I was attempting wiring. The Chinese alum is doing fine. But the dawn redwood I thought was lost, but it seems to pick up a bit. Obviously you may see that they are not in full contact, contact with the sun all the time. I opted for the middle of the road, sunshine and shade. Well, lads and lasses, I hope the intro you understand. But what I'll do is get into the unboxing. Here you go. Hi lads and lasses, welcome to a basic overview of a garden tool I've just purchased. From the off offset, I got sick and tired of lawnmowers petrol especially petrol mowers that going to get fuel oil mixing it filling it up eventually trying to start it yeah and once it runs that's okay but when anything, anything happens as in it don't doesn't work uh, either you know carburetor or whatever just I had enough. The next one was the electric lawnmowers for cutting all the the leads or the extensions. Pain in the butt. It's all right once it's running, but all the time the the leads get in the way, the extension gets snagged, and honestly, I had I'd had enough. So I thought. Hmm, what about them them battery powered ones? Might might work. As some may know my mobility isn't good. Good days and bad days. But as far as looking at operating a mower, that's going to be catch twenty two. But I'm thinking I will need a helper. All said and done about mobility, maybe this video will be helpful to people with similar disabilities of myself or 
people that just want just sick and tired of the petrol engines and the electric motors with the extension leads etc